welcome to Vlogmas. Um, this is going to be a weekly Vlogmas because I'm awful at vlogging and remembering to vlog, so there's a great chance there will be days that I don't vlog, like yesterday. Um, yesterday was December 1st, and I actually did so much. Like, I just really annoyed I didn't vlog, but um, I started the morning with breakfast with my four girlfriends, or three girlfriends and me, and I'm sure you can imagine how that went. We were all just gossiping <laughs> and talking about boys and eating breakfast, so um, we did that, and then my roommate Caitlin and I went for a walk around this park with my dog because she had been inside for the last two days, like not all day, but like consistently, and so she, we wanted to get her out, so we walked around the park for a bit. And then we went to, um, then we went looking for our Christmas tree, as you can see right there. Um, this was a whole debacle, well, mainly for me, because I've always bought my Christmas tree from a lot, and my parents buy, like, the biggest tree in a lot. Like, when we go looking for Christmas trees, it's not even, like, a, we don't really look around, because you, we literally just say, we want the biggest one in the lot, um. And that's always how it's been. But I've always bought a tree from a lot where you can walk around. Like, you know, the people own the lot. And the trees are all up. They're not just, like, you know, strewn to the side. And so um, I really wanted to go to a lot. And it's definitely more expensive when you buy from a lot. And so, like it is with anything small, like small businessy. y um, And so we went to, like, two different Lowe's, a Home Depot, another tree lot. And I was just so torn because I knew I wanted to save money but it just felt like so I don't know I felt like such a bad person to buy one from Home Depot and that was totally just me getting in like my head or whatever but it felt weird going to Home Depot to Lowe's and they're just piled like dead bodies like that's how it felt um so anyway we got our tree at Lowe's we got a stand at Lowe's and then we went to home we went to Target and Target was having this deal where if you bought a hundred dollars worth of holiday stuff you got fifty dollars off um and so we got $100 worth of stuff for $50. So it's all strewn across our TV console. So there's a ton of stuff over there. Um, yeah, and then we spent the rest of the day putting up the tree. So once it falls, I'll do some footage of us decorating it. We have like, we bought like a box of like gold ornaments. I think we're gonna go for like a gold theme. Um, but yeah, so that was yesterday. And then I went to my parents' house and my dog opened her advent calendar for the first time. And I grabbed that from their house. So that's in my car. Um, but yeah, that was basically the day. We watched some Christmas movies and went to bed. So today is Monday and I work from home on Mondays, so right now it is 8.30. Um, I walked my dog, ate breakfast, I, um, she's playing the toy, um, walked dog, ate breakfast, started the wash, the dishwasher because adulthood, and now I, on Mondays I almost always go to a coffee shop to work for the first, um, like, few hours or so of my day just because I feel weird starting my day at home working. I think, oh no, I bought this like thing on Small Business Saturday from this girl's shop. I'll link it down below. Um, Abby Paul House, Paul House. And anyway, it's this really cute weekly planner that I'm planning to use for Vlogmas. So I can write down all the things I'm doing. But um, tonight, oh, tonight I have, I'm doing, I have this like girl group that um, it's called Hustle Honeys and it comes together. And it's just a bunch of girls who have these goals and we all support each other. It sounds really weird, and it, but it's basically like a club for people at college. Um, can you hear my dog sniffing at the carpet? Anyway, um, anyway, so I have that tonight. We're all just gonna meet up and hang out. Um, and then on Wednesday, I'm going to see Love Actually, so I'll probably vlog that, but welcome to Vlogmas.
You gotta wait till I open it. You gotta wait till I open it. Yeah, you said in good girl. Oh no, I messed it up. I know, I'm very concerned. Okay, here we go. Riley, what's this? Come get it. What's this? Daddy. Oh, here, no, let me help you. Here, get it. Get it. Good girl. So I just got back from the coffee shop. For you guys, it's been like two seconds, but for me, it's been a couple hours. It's almost 1.40 now, so I'm just going to make some lunch. I think I'm just going to have um, some soup because it's easy. I keep getting all these soups from Trader Joe's. Um, this one's my favorite. It's a hearty minestrone soup. Um, but yeah, it tastes been kind of weird. Um, like, um, I had this dream about this guy that I used to date, and... I always thought that was weird and something that people like, um, you know, didn't happen to other people. And then I watched Lexi Lombard's video and someone asked her about this ex she had a while ago and she still thinks about him. And she's like, not really, but he pops up in my dreams sometimes. And that's exactly how it is with this guy. Um, we were really good friends for a long time. And so he was really ingrained in my life. And now, um, now he's like obviously no longer and I don't think about him hardly ever like not daily I wouldn't even say weekly um and um yeah he just pops up in my dreams sometimes and it really throws me more than it should it kind of like messes up my day and I thought I would just tell you about it because I think I didn't know that that happened to other people um until I'm sorry this is really gross um until Lexi talked about it so I don't know leave me a comment if that ever happens to you because it's really weird it's not that um like it's not like I don't know it's just weird isn't it weird relationships are weird like that um but anyway it's been a weird morning really busy I usually don't stay that late at this coffee shop but I've just had so much to do and it was just a weird start to my morning. So, gonna have some soup. Riley just opened her advent calendar and now she's just sitting in the spot where we opened it waiting for more treats, which is really funny. Um, but there you go. Car vlog. So, like I said before, I'm at this event with a few of my friends um, for Hustle Honeys. So, if I'm ballsy, I will um, film a few clips. If not, um, I'll catch you guys tomorrow set these goals for yourself or you set this plan for yourself or whatever for yourself and you're like oh it's for myself like I can just I can do that tomorrow or right? you don't stick to things for yourself so you're gonna laugh or maybe you won't I don't know I got back from my event with Hustle Honeys which was amazing and so good and I've been on this huge kick recently that my skin is really dry and I can't get it out of my head that I need to get um, dermaplaning done because I've had it done before and it just made my skin feel so good and so fresh and so um, because I'm poor right now and I can't afford to go to get my skin done I was like oh I'll just go to CVS and I'll buy some little razors and I end up cutting myself all over my face but on the bright side my skin feels really smooth um, but anyway I'm gonna finish my skincare routine now which I know you've been asking about um and I just got this moisturizer that I'm hyped on from um Trader Joe's of all places and it's an ultra uh hydrating gel moisturizer and it feels like water on your skin like it feels like you're actually putting water on your skin so that's cool um yeah I just wanted to share so that was funny and one time at this blogger I follow Rachel Martino um talked about how she got these like long chin hairs and she didn't know where they came from and I was like, wow, I thought it was the only one that uh, happened to. So here we are talking about my peach fuzz. But if you have peach fuzz and you're concerned about the texture of your skin, leave me a comment because I don't want to be alone. <laughs>
Tuesday. I didn't vlog at all today. It's now nine o'clock at night and I'm in bed with Riley and we're just settling down to watch Sex and the City because I'm hooked on it and I've been trying to like get through it just really fast. I don't know why, but I just feel this need, this pressure to get through it. Um, but yeah, I went to work today and not much exciting stuff happened. Um, I got lunch with the marketing team um, where I work and my boss and one of our interns and that was really good except for I think whatever I ate made me really sick. I had like this piercing stomach ache when I left the office so that was no fun but yeah that's what we did today. Um, I'm really excited for tomorrow. I'm going to see Love Actually in theaters with my friend Cheyenne and we're also filming two different spotlights. Um, well I'm we film basically every Wednesday at work um, for different content, but um, tomorrow I'm in two of them. So I have to bring two different outfits and be cute. And then straight from work, I'm going to this Love Actually thing and I have a Love Actually shirt. So I'll be making three costume changes today or tomorrow. Um, so that'll be fun. But I just wanted to um, put a clip in. I just closed one of my goals. Um, I wanted to put a clip in so that I could show you Riley's advent calendar for today, which- Okay, come here. Okay, where's day three? Where's three? Where's three? Like actually, where's three? Mm -hmm. Oh, here it is. Look, right here, right here, right here. This keeps happening. I know, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Here you go, look, what's this? Get it. They did not, I know, I'm sorry. Okay, here. Good girl. There's another one. You gotta eat that one first. Oh, you don't like it. Really? You've eaten all of these? Here, try this. I thought it was really funny because I think she's trying to figure out what an advent calendar is. So, anywho, um, hope you enjoyed that and see you tomorrow. So, I literally. What are you doing? Can you see her arm? <laughs> she's like, don't move. Um, I literally filmed that clip and then I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't update them on my cut face that I filmed the other night. So, um, update my skin. I feel like the makeup stayed on my skin so much better today after like shaving off that peach fuzz. And I just wanted to give that update because I did see a difference and I feel like I feel a difference on my skin. So it worked. I feel accomplished. I have a few extra cuts on my face, um, but they're not notice what I don't have any makeup on I have like a cut there and like cut up here but that'll give you the entertainment um update on my skin <laughs> Tammy, what are we doing? Oh my gosh, we are <laughs> filming here in the office. I was literally just turning to ask you like how does my hair look since it's gonna be on it's, camera. It's good. But it really doesn't matter to anyone but me. So thanks for joining us and <laughs> into behind the blog. And being boozled. How hyped are you? Oh my gosh, I hope I get spoiled milk. Hello and welcome to Thursday. I almost forgot what day it was. Um, I didn't really vlog that much yesterday. You can see me in the mirror. Um, I didn't really vlog that much yesterday. I I think I filmed the clip. I don't know. You saw it. Anyway, that's what I did yesterday. Um, and then I went to a movie last night with my friends. We went to see Love Actually and I'll insert a picture. I'm a huge Love Actually fan. So that was really fun. It was weird seeing it in theaters and like sitting with a bunch of people while watching it because usually it's like me and my dad and we're obsessed with that movie. So it was also funny. My two friends who were there um, either haven't seen it or haven't seen it in a really long time. And so there'd be parts where I was like, oh my god, I love this part. And they're just like, look over at me like, what? So, love, love, actually. Um, today, I'm going to work. Shocker, it's a Thursday. And we're actually decorating our Christmas tree today. So I need to go to Target. I'm going to get an ornament because we're supposed to bring an ornament that represents us. And so I'm going to get a Star Wars ornament because I bought a Star Wars ornament last year. And I think that's just a fun tradition. And I'm going to go to Target and get some sweets and some... Oh my god. And some um, drinky drinks because... Nothing gets you in the spirit like treats and drinky drinks. So we're gonna do that. Um, and then hopefully we're gonna decorate our tree tonight because 
it's been falling over the last few days and it hasn't really fallen that much so we're hoping we can like adjust it a little bit and then put some ornaments on it um but I did every day I'm like I'm gonna show them my outfit before I go to work I'm gonna talk to them before I go to work so this is the first day I'm doing it but I will show you my outfit in the mirror really quick okay so you can ignore my unmade bed because my dog is on it and god forbid I make the bed while she's on it she looks like she's done something wrong um but yeah so I have this sweater it's from Mod Cloth. I actually got it on Poshmark from our Depop from Noelle Downing Felt like it was cute for decorating the tree and then I have these jeans from Old Navy actually and they're a little big I actually sized down in them and they're still too big because Old Navy jeans stretch and then I don't know what shoes I'm gonna wear I have this bucket where shoes that I've worn look how bad my nails are um shoes that I've worn during the week I just throw them in this bucket and then I put them away this is a whole wreck once I've worn them um, or at the end of the week so I'm gonna get a pair of shoes probably gonna cop those Adidas one more time for the week but this is the vibe, so.